What's up everybody? So today I want to show you how to remove the blade and replace the blade on a Jet 13 inch planer. So you see I already have the top pulled off. The casing here um, has four of these Allen wrench. It's a five millimeter Allen wrench. So you go ahead and pull those four pieces off and then you got to pull this knob off the left hand side of here you gotta pull that off and then obviously take the crank off which the crank is held on by with the tool that comes with the uh, whole device which is in this little foam casing so you pull that i think it's like a three millimeter so pull that the whole thing will come off and then you'll access obviously this whole thing so then you can read through the instructions here but what they're telling you to do is to take this casing off so remove this screw and this screw which is with the allen that they provide so i'm going to pull that off and then we'll take a look there's the blade um there's this metal piece here that when you take this cover off it releases pressure. So normally it's like this with the cover on and then it releases pressure, which locks this blade in. So now it doesn't move. So now we can pull everything that we need to do. So basically what you do is just one at a time. So you've gotten all six of these screws tightened up and then you have pushed up on this, rolled it around, and then the, done that a second time. Exact same process, obviously. And then we're gonna take this guy, just like how we took him off, we're gonna do the reverse and throw him right back in, making sure he gets over that little break. Because when, you can, you can kind of see it move a little bit. So that's that break. It's going to push that down. So we want to push that down. And then these screws will go right back in. <coughs> these two guys will go right back in. And once you get those snugged up, then we'll finish this out. So we got that back panel on. We can pretty much just put this guy away. We make sure we're good to go. I'm gonna look under here and try to spin it. So it spins no problem. That means the brake released. So we have our, our crank laying there. And what we're going to do is we're going to lift this guy up. We're going to kind of start by getting it a little bit centered up. And then we just got to make sure that the arm with this lever goes over the top. Done. And if you successfully do it, you'll have everything rolling everywhere if you're stupid. But... So yeah, get these four bolts put in. Remember they're uh, five millimeter. It's a little different. Get them guys started. Might have to shake this, make sure these guys are lined up. And then we can put the crank back on as well. That guy is gonna add a little, a little key on it. And then just take your uh, piece from the, from the factory here. Run that guy tight. Tighten up these guys. And we're good to go. That's how you replace uh, or reverse the blades on some year version of a 13 inch jet planer. Let me know what you think.